Hello everyone, it's Sparkling Shire and welcome back to my channel. I was coming in to do a, well I want to do a project share, but I also want to show you my way, my method of, my process. Whatever. So, yeah, so it'll be a, it's not going to be a long video, but it's going to be a video. So, grab some coffee, let's do this. So you guys know I'm just like I'm I'm I got projects all over the place, but I'm kind of stuck on the memory decks game. So I want to uh show you um how I go about doing mine and what I, I do. So I'm going to be putting one together and I'll show you how I do it. Of course you guys already know how to do it. I'm going to show you my way. So you just do pick your paper and go in four by four of whatever you want to use. I normally use a piece of car, white cardstock or something underneath. Um, or you can use the same paper the same kind of paper, you know. And um, so I have my 4x4 four four and <clears throat> I use my tab punch. I'm really not good at this. Am I trying? Yeah. So I'm really not good at making these, but I'll do the one say large. Only thing I hate about We Are Memories Keeper, you really can't see. Let me bring it down. You really can't see the letters. I, If you can see, I kind of darken man up. So I'm going to go with the large tab. Ooh. <clears throat> Push that. And then you turn it and you measure over here for the large one just so you can get a tab. Oh, God. Ooh. That took a lot out of me. And, <laughs> and then you're supposed to put it on this side. To line it up and cut it, you take this out. I don't know how to use that, so because I'm always cutting way down here, so I'll figure that out sooner or later. But I just, I just eye it. So I just cut. I don't have to cut on this side. I just need to cut on this side, and then I get my corner rounder. Where is that at? And around the corners, you can go half, you can go a quarter. I usually do half sometimes. And, yeah. And I already have made me a template. So, I just, sorry for shaking. I just take it and punch the holes in it. And cut this out. Bless you. <clears throat> and that's how I do mine. See? Yeah, so you can round this little corner if you want to. Round that off. And that's my 4x4. Um, four four. So I'm going to put mine together right quick. I've already picked out. Uh, Y'all know my polka doodles. Polka doodles. Yes with my phone and uh, we're going to put this together right quick okay so um, I just sit here and think about how I want it to be and she can either go on this side but I want her on this side and I want my phone there oh wait I want her jacket like so. My phone right here. And my and her cup of coffee, rather, my cup of coffee. Her coffee there. And then I found this little hat that say woohoo. So I'm gonna place that on her head. Because I think she look cute with that hat. I don't know if I want to cover one of her eyes. What do you think? Or I want to show both her eyes because 
cocoa doodles are beautiful. So, and I was trying to find a skateboard. Um, I could have printed out one, but I just didn't have time. But I wouldn't have had no room to put it on here anyway because I feel like a skateboard, a skateboard should have been in this here thing. So, um, let me get my art glitter glue and let me get to doing what I need to do. So I'm going to put her jacket down first. No, I'm going to put her down first. I already put the stickers on here. I know my process videos usually be like take it forever. Like I'm trying to beat the clock, which I really am. Okay, so I'm going to place her here, push down, and I'm going to take her jacket, I'm going to put her jacket down. Ugh, this is our glitter glue, this stuff dries so fast. Let's see here. It's coming out slowly. I don't know why. Oh. Okay, I don't know. Sorry for shaking the camera, guys. <laughs> why every time when you on the video, when you doing a video, stuff just don't go right? That's the craziest stuff. Now the glue won't come out. And I've been using this glue all morning. Yeah. Sorry, guys. Let's see. Yeah. Let's see if it's going to come out now. There we go. Oh, my God. Well, oh, my goodness. Okay, so I'm going to put her jacket right there. And then her phone. So I had today off, guys. I was so excited. I slept late. Yeah. I was too happy. Because last week I had a rough week. I told you guys. I was like, should I pop this up? I think I'm going to pop this up with some dimensions. I use dimensions or, well, stamping up dimensions or... That Dollar Tree, I like they, they things too. Yeah, but as I as I was saying, I had a rough week last week. Oh my goodness! I think I'm due for. I'm gonna take some days off just to relax because my body is like really just shutting down. Okay, so that's her coffee, and then I'm gonna. I have dimensioned her cap already. And we just about almost done with this. This is my process, how I do it. I don't, I don't want to block her eye, but she looks so cute like that, right? Am I in frame? I'm sorry. Oh. Make sure her hat. Cute. Woohoo. That is too cute. Now, I want to... I'm going to stickle some things. You know, y'all know I'm like loving this stickle stuff. So, um, let's see. Um, I just like bring, like, you know, just bring it out a little bit. Just want to bring out some things on it. Just highlight what you want to highlight. Like I'm highlighting a coffee cup and stuff. And her jacket. I want to bring that out. I got to re restock my stickle, guys, because I'm like going stickle crazy with this memory deck stuff. I don't, it, it's not a lot of thought going in what I'm doing. And uh, I'm going to 
bring out her little shoes. I got some pink I could have used, but that pink is like not doing good. I'll bling out her. I like <sighs> I'm bling crazy, right? I know. Let's bring out her hat. Put a little ball up there. Yeah. Oh, this is too cute. These polka doodle girls. Girl, I'm telling y'all I love it. Now I'm going to bring out a little gold in her hair. Bring out the little gold in her hair. Not much. Just her highlights. She's going to be too cute. Going out for a little bit. And um, her eyes, they're brown. So I want to, like, dab them up a little bit so they can sparkle. Not too much. What? Well, don't want to come out now. Come on. Hold on, guys. Oh, jeez. Oh, see? Not too much, though. Bring her eyes out a little bit. And her hair right here. Oh, my gosh. See? Just what a little little um, stickle would do. And um, I'm going to stickle up the background just a bit. Like I said, I got some more colors over here, but I don't want to... My pink and stuff, it don't act right. So, I'm like using this. I think this is called like a diamond color. I think we done. I need to put a word right there, right? Let me find a word. What's well, words on here, but I guess it's good enough. And uh, I could have used like a little. Well, anyway. So, yeah, that's. Oh, that's my process on my memory decks card. So, sorry guys. So, I've been really, really busy. I'm jumping from one project to the next. I need to get that under control for real because it's taking me longer to do my projects. But, I'm like, I just love what I do. And I'm going to, if I got to walk away from a project because I don't want to mess it up, I will. And then I'll come back to it. So, with that being said, you see my little polka doodle right here? Uh, you can make them any size you want. Uh, loving my new print and everything. I got all my ephemera over here. Oh, guys, I want to say, I'm still making them. Like, I got to do this Barbie one. But the Barbies come from the Valentine Barbies. This I had from last year. So, all I'm doing is cutting them out. You know how I do my ephemera. Just cut it out. So, I got to do my Barbies and stuff. And, yeah. I get some of my ephemera off Etsy or whatever, whatever, whatever. But, I want to show you guys that I, you guys really give me inspiration. And, uh, from my last memory deck um, thing, everyone comment just blew me away. I was so excited about it. And, each comment was different and I love it. But, when I got to, um... To read them and, and comment to back, there was a uh, pink zebra, the unicorn, and I'm typing the, to her response to reply. I'm sorry, guys, but I got this straight. I'm typing her response to reply, right? And I was like, oh my goodness, girl, you just inspired me. I'm going to make zebras and unicorns. I promise y'all. I promise you. It's so crazy because we're going to put... Let's put this January girl to the side so she can dry right quick. I got so inspired that I started making all kind of animals. So this is my um my first one. This is with the birds, the butterflies, and all that, the wording, dream, life is beautiful. My next one was uh, how cute is this? <laughs> Yes, I know, right? I whoop you. Hello, gorgeous. Too cute with the little bow. And then this one was the camp. This this is the camp campers. 
It's got like the fire. And I had this little camper charm that I got from Michaels. I hooked that on there and then it said Camp Yippee. That's what it's called. Camp Yippee. You got the little dog there. This was too cute. And this this whole thing I won from off of Angelina's channel. Angelina's Treasures. Really cute, right? Y'all ready for the unicorn and the zebra? <laughs> Isn't this gorgeous? Just gorgeous. It say Chase the Rainbow. Wonderful. And then I have this sticker. I don't know. I should have put it right here to say Let's Be Unicorns. I figure out somewhere to put this. Because I really want this on here. But I will work that out some kind of way. That's the only thing about the 4 by 4 You can already put so much on it, right? And then look at the pink zebra. Pink zebra unicorn girl. Look at what you have inspired. This is so cute. I put the little grass down here. And they say the little things too freaking cute, right? And then, last thing with the little fur babies, our animals. Hello, kitty! <laughs> and it has a little charm I got from Michaels. How adorable is this? Too stinking cute, right? I know. I know. Get the air freshener. It's too stinking cute. Yes. So, these are our animals. Up next, we're going to put these to the side. I know. This, I had to finish filling up my box anyway. So, that's why I made these. Okay. Up next is um, the fashion industry. I, I'm crazy. I, I just overthink things. So, this is... Um, <laughs> just do it. Be creative. The, the sewing machine, the hangers, the, what you call it, dress form. You got the needle and thread. Scissors. Just awesome. Just awesome. This is the back. And some of them I did decorate the back and some I haven't got to yet. But, yeah. So, this was uh, gifted to me by Casca's Design. She gifted me the cutout for that. Yeah, she's so sweet, guys. Which made me think about, when I said fashion, made me think of one from Paris. This is a, I forget what Etsy shop I got this from, but it's a sheet. These are stickers. And then it's the word Paris. She's cute. I'm sorry about all the shaking, guys. I keep bumping into it. Check this one out. Gone, girl. Yes. It say, give a girl the right shoes and she can conquer the world. Marilyn Monroe. And then I got the little shoe, um, the shoe dangle right here. This come from uh, Casca's Designs. I'm not Casca's Designs. Natasha Scrapbook Corner. Gorgeous, right? Yes. And then talking about a boss lady. Boss lady. Ain't nothing but boss ladies in this. I'm telling you. And I was making this and... <laughs> Got to thinking about beauty. Well, Rose, which is beauty boss planner. She changed her name. Uh oh. She changed. Guys, I'm so excited and nervous. She changed her name, but look at this. Get it, girl. Yes, boss bay. Like a boss, go slay. Planners got a plan. Planners gonna plan. And then it say here, I'm very busy. Either she texts that to somebody off her iPad or somebody texts that to her, but you better believe it was a female that did it. And Z formation, baby. That's right. <laughs> so these are too cute, right? I gotta stop making these. I think I'm gonna stop now because I filled up my box. So and then I gotta find some memory that shines to go to. Now, up next is my January babies. Oh yes. These girls are just so cute. Look at her. Fabulous day. This is the one. Remember I made the one with the car? And I told you she was actually reading a book. That is the one. And I just put a, a hair clip on it. See? Just clipped a, a hair clip right there. And brought out her blue eyes. She's so pretty. She's so cute. Having a fabulous day. Yeah. Reading is fundamental. And then this is the next one. Now, I don't know. I don't know. This is like... Wow, I just really love this black and red. Oh, my God. She is too cute. This word love was given to me by Farisha in my swap last time. This was a um 
uh, wine hook, but I changed it into a, you know, one of the things and put some little words here. Say hello, sunshine. It say beautiful. And it's got the black hearts on it. I don't know. It, it might like, I don't know. It's just something about this one. Just like, woo! look at her blue eyes. They so pretty. And then this is another one from Polka Doodles. Uh, what is this girl called? I forget her name, but whatever. Flower power, baby. You are beautiful. Ain't she pretty? Look at her blue eyes. Oh, my God. Just gorgeous. This dress. This whole scene is just, just something. And then on the back of this one, it's like a little uh, tuck pocket. Let me see if I got something to show you. I can stick down in there. Yeah. Oops. Sorry. This is like a little tuck pocket. When you tuck your info. And it says, stop and smell the wildflowers. Gorgeous, right? Girls, I'm telling you. And then, of course, this January baby right here. Yes, right. Okay. Now, for the finale, my inspiration came from my daughter. It is Black History Month. Black History Month, yep. Yeah. And the university is throwing what they call an essence ball at their university. And I thought about her, and I put this together for her. What? Yes, I know. Just elegant and fab. Too cute. I was going to get a picture of her and put here, but I was like, that would take too long for me to resize, blah, 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 and everything. But this is the color she's wearing, black and gold. This purse here was given to me by Casca's Designs. And I took the top of, what you call them, girl? The LOL girl? Not the LOL. Yes, yeah, LOL. I mean, it. I did a Marie Antoinette on her. Sorry about the glare. <laughs> I took her head off, but I'll figure out something to do with this one. Yeah, it's cute, right? I took her. I, I had to use her head. Too pretty, right? Yes, I know. Sorry about all the bling, but this time my baby gonna be looking Saturday. She got her black and gold going on, oh, girl. Yes, girl. So, yes, guys, this is what I've been working on. Thank you for coming to see my little process video. And I'll put these girls, all these girls back out. <sighs> I'm too excited. Don't you get excited when your projects just go so perfect? Everything just works out so perfect. Ugh, so gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh my God. It's just so many. These little bowls. So cute. So yes, guys. And now, I'm going to give myself an award for this. And the Emmy goes to Sparkly Star. I don't, I don't know why I got this. This is a prop my kids had at their prom last year. It was a Hollywood prom night. So, I think it goes well. I should get an Emmy for this one, right? <laughs> oh, crazy. Okay, guys. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. And don't forget, go over there and do, follow the tutorials from Crafty Mermaid Mom. Because she got me going on a roll. Thank you, Dolly. And uh, remember to always sparkle. Bye now.